<sighs> and in general, I'm like very excited about books again, which makes me very happy. And I've got some new story ideas, even though at the moment I'm still in a bit of a writer's block for like various reasons. But I have something in my mind that I'd like to try. But again, right now I'm like really, really scared to start writing again because I haven't written anything in so long that there's just like this mental barrier to, you know, it might not be as good as anything I've written before. I might have lost some skill and it could not be perfect on the first draft because, oh no, as we all know, first drafts are where, uh, where the real perfection is at. So yeah, right now I'm just kind of struggling to actually start something. I've been meaning to for like a few weeks, a few months, but you know, I'm hoping to get something into my brain for NaNoWriMo, National Novel Writing Month, which is in November. But the thing is, um, the NaNoWriMo company uh, did like weird sketchy stuff and I don't really want to support them anymore. So like a lot of other writers were now kind of like what the heck are we gonna do in November? We don't even want to call it NaNoWriMo, so... <sighs> yeah, I have to see what we're gonna do there. But I'd like to write again sooner and just get back and do the good stuff, get motivated again. Okay, nice. A laggy forest with snow. Ah, I'll take it. Look, little change of scenery, I guess. <laughs> and it does look very cozy. Uh, do we have an extra boat? We have an extra boat. And since we organize... Oh! Same to me just again. Okay, sure thing. And we'll just make our way through. I thought those were the more Nemesias. I am now on this little Nemesia fever, I guess. And I want to get some of... Wait, actually, I think... Yeah, we didn't need shears for them. Okay. Is there really another ocean already? <laughs> Come on. I didn't get out of break. Not just get out of the boat, I didn't break the boat for like two steps on land. Come on. At least we're getting some nice plants out of this. Do we have the loamy grass blocks, by the way? I don't know if we do. We might not. And we don't have sick touch. We have a sick touch pickaxe, though. Nice. You know, just in case we don't have these. And I think they also, yeah, they also had the dirt. Yes. Uh, actually, this is kind of weird, because... <laughs> Should I just leave the... Ra I'm just gonna leave this random hole. Okay. Wait, I got two blocks, though. Thank you. I already destroyed the environment. I at least want the full... Full result. <laughs> uh, that goes in there. Those go in there. And these two go into blocks. <laughs> I really hope we don't have them yet, otherwise I'm going to feel very bad. Okay, we'll just keep walking along there after we got the pretty flowers. Looks cute. Imagine if we find an origin island now, just as we're casually walking around, not even like directly looking for anything. If we find a structure, I'd really appreciate it. But, you know, we don't have to. Right now, this is just about the experience. Please imagine the, like, sparkle emojis in front and after experience, just to, like, really empathize. If this is a thing that we're doing. Hello. Wow. Crazy. I know, right? Okay, I was about to ask if we should maybe go in the ocean instead, but I guess uh, the answer to that is no. Yeah. 
that looked like a house for a second and I was like, what the actual murder mansion heck is that? Oh <laughs> god, that looked like a roof at first. Can't blame me for that. Maybe I do have a little structure addiction, okay? They're very fun. And since we always find like new exciting ones that I've never seen before in my years of playing, I do enjoy to to keep finding them. Hey. Okay. Cute though. What is this biome? Snow. Ah, okay. Confurious Vloggy Forest. And this is just a cool type. Okay. Need to remember the biome names again. I was doing so, so, so well. And then I just didn't play for ages. Oh, is the there's the fungi forest probably down there. Cool. But we're gonna keep going our originally scheduled way. Is it getting dark again already? Come on. Don't do this to me. Okay, I guess we can at least <laughs> organize our inventory. <laughs> please, please let the I'll take that. <laughs> Lavender fields over jungle any day. Definitely. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We put that back in. Put this into plants and then all of these go into flowers. Oh, oh that's the fungi forest. Okay. I just don't know directions, but who was surprised? Doesn't look very okay. Okay, it does look. I was about to be like, it's not very fungi in there, but it is. I'm sorry. I judged too early. Don't judge a biome by its outer shell. Do we have mycelium? I'm pretty sure we do. I think we got we got some when we were at the mushroom island that we found a while ago. We don't need to get any. Catch us not having any at home. Jacaranda! Jacaranda saplings. Now I remember the name. <laughs> Look at that. Hector! <laughs> Just I think this might I think this is one without any dude. But that's okay. Hey! Ah, uh, glow flower. I love glow flowers. The light of Madeira? Madeira? Just checking. That's cute! Like, I just love finding these random little things in the world. Like, I don't know. The roof looks really nice, I should take that as, as inspiration. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to mark this, because... Why? I have a screenshot of it and it is on video, what else could we possibly want, you know? Uh, we're not going the right way, we need to go this way. <laughs> Completely threw me out of it. And like like that? Okay. Just a little hiccup, I guess. That's okay. Not going to sue the game for that. Any... yes, some more lavender. More lavender. If it's free, we're taking it, okay? Ah, oh, cute little piggies! Hello! <sighs> I don't want to fall into... Ah, there's a skeleton in that cave. I am out of here. Goodbye. I feel like these lavender fields, yeah, lavender fields, 
tend to spawn a lot more structures than some other biomes. But maybe I'm just imagining things, but maybe not. Who knows? It's my little conspiracy theory now. Okay, the lavender going into the swamp also looks kind of nice. Not gonna lie. Oh, that gives me ideas. Ah, so many things we could do. And so many things that we have to do. Uh, let's let's just keep traveling forever so we don't have to worry about all the work that we have at home. <laughs> that just like a normal plains biome, it appears to be. And I will take some of the 2D ferns. Um, I'm gonna try to walk a little bit closer to the border to the plains biome. Just in case we could get a village on the atlas. Which right now is not the case, but... I have hopes. <laughs> ah, pine tree. Ah, we've been seeing a lot of those lately. Okay, yeah, uh, so much. Quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. Yes, yes, I agree, I agree. So much to our potential village, but... Hey. <laughs> Considering the previous villages have all been rather small, I accept it. I'd rather save one or two villages and then get a nice big one the next time we find one. Because that is definitely how it works, right? Still going the right direction. What was that? Meadow grass. You don't need a fucking year tunes for that. <laughs> Also, a sentence that I think I say a lot in this let's play. <laughs> like whenever we're just collecting stuff. And it, it, it looks leafy and green. Oh, I thought he had shoes for that. It looks so pretty! Little chickens! <gasps> I... I really shouldn't have not played for so long. Like, how, how dare I be busy with finals and breaking my collarbone when I could be playing the cute little prick pretty pixel game. Oh, crack biome, great. <laughs> uh, all joy was lost in that moment. I mean, they look amazing, but they can be a little bit laggy and, you know, having to go through them can also be a little bit of a hassle. Um, for now we'll put that away. That goes in there. <laughs> uh, d don't crash. Okay, my PC just lagged. That that's alright, as long as it doesn't crash, I'll take the lags. Um, maybe we should go <laughs> through that biome, through like the dead forest or whatever it's called. Uh, we'll, we'll ta also take out an ancient burger that we made like over half a year ago. That uh, tastes very well, I promise. I mean, it does look crazy. And like, it never really has a chance to fully generate before you already are out of rendering distance again. But it is... Oh, especially with the waterfalls. Looks wonderful. Imagine building on top of there in this version without Elytra. Good luck. <laughs> I mean, at least we have the waystone smart added, so it could be possible, but eh, I don't think I'd want to live there. Oh god, don't, don't, don't lag so much, please. I just want to get through here. No, don't, don't load it in there. No, 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 no. please, please don't. I just wanna do my leave spawns. That is something that I didn't know. That's cool. Didn't know it spawned in the water too. I just wanted to walk through here. Uh Okay, maybe we can get through underneath there if if we can even get there without well, too many problems. Not what I <clears throat> what I thought I'd signed up for today. 
Eh, do black. Please do black. Don't do this to me. Okay. Okay, this is doable. This is doable. This is okay. I'll take that. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. I'll take a little bog over the crack. No, I didn't mean to take a screenshot. <laughs> you know, in between my millions of screenshots that I mean to take, it was, oh, it's, it's yet another pretty place, and let's take five screenshots of the coordinates to the pretty place that we will literally never return to, but take the screenshot because you never know. Then you have these random screenshots in between, and I'm like, if I would ever, like, look through them, I mean, occasionally I do when I look for something, and... You know, even when I notice it's not at all what I'm looking for, I just, you know, like looking through them, admiring the pretty places <laughs> and stuff like that. Then I come across the random screenshots of coordinates because I accidentally pressed F2 instead of pressing F3 again and I'm just like, what did I intend to capture here? Was, is there something crazy about this place? Is, is there like a structure that... Uh, uh, yeah? Especially when there's nothing else in the next few... In, like in the screenshot before and after. I mean, that was then usually a sign that I was an oopsie, but you never know with me. <laughs> I never know with me. Ah, <laughs> oh, little little autumn forest ahead. Perfect. Also, I'm a little bit sad that we're travel tractor <laughs> traveling now, and it is October, and we haven't decorated. But we're not going to be out and about for 30 episodes, I think. We have quite a few of those saplings. We don't have enough lands. Thank you, game. I, I really wanted those. Very, very kind of you. I was missing those lags in my lag collection still. Um. Yeah, we're, we're gonna decorate our house for, for Spooktober a little bit. And... Seasonal forest. Okay, not autumn forest. Seasonal forest. Let's try to keep that in mind. We need to sleep again soonish. Hey. Don't lag like that, please. Really appreciate it if you wouldn't. Anything that we missed? Not from the immediate looks of it. Ah, nice. Screenshot, 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 screenshot. Ah. Wonderful. If we ever forget the bed, then we have problems because we haven't shown any. Is it also shown or sheared? Shared? She. We haven't stolen wool of any innocent sheep just yet. I don't know if we are going to. You know, we're just we're not collecting that much today. We're just vibing still, getting in the experience. I mean, if we actually happen to lose it and then we don't have a bed with us, that would be very unfortunate. And like this, we could just craft a new one. That would be very fortunate. Oh, those, those biomes spawn very pretty flowers. These biomes... Grasslands? Grassland. Um, can spawn villages. In my first main world, I built in one of these biomes and there was a village a little bit behind my house. So this, this would... A little bit of nostalgia for me. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll take a little peek in there. You guys okay? Okay, you, you keep doing your thing. Enjoy. I, I won't look anymore, I promise. Just take a little peek. And also, there tends to be a lot of or spawn at the surface. So let me grab that and put this back down there if the game lets me. Also marble usually, but now we have chalk. There is an imposter among these stones. <laughs> just just like a little bit, you know, if we're already here we might as well. Now still chalk, limestone, a 
a little bit of a lag. Where is the pretty stuff? I saw one on like the mountain edge when we first looked over here. But like for real. Oh, I think that's marble. What is this biome, by the way? Shield. Okay. If we don't have the shields as items, we have them as biomes. We don't need silk touch for marble. <laughs> if we're already here and the marble is already here and we're collecting some stuff anyway, and we need to use our backpacks anyway, we might as well. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Sneaky guy, I, I, I didn't really notice him at first. He just kind of blended in with the environment. Seek to just back. Ah, more, more stuff to mine. <laughs> just after I said we're not here for the grind, we're just here for the experience. Um, this, is, this is an interactive tourist attraction, okay? This, this is what, what the people want you to do. Ah. Well, I was about to fall down there for a second. You could get a little bit more salt, that would actually be nice, because there's a lot of cooking that I would like to do. And, you know, also prepare a little bit of stuff for the food storage. And I, I don't just want one of every item. Like, with some things I want multiple. And a lot of things require salt. And yeah, I mean, you can get it with water buckets and a pot. But that is so grindy. <laughs> so, if we can just get salt the natural way... That is also very nice and a little bit more convenient, considering there's already so many things that I need to do in my little off-screen time. I'm just not getting around to enough, really. Like farming some Judah yeah. fiber for more backpacks and especially for a burlap for bookshelves for the cabin mountains. Very important. And books for the bibliocraft bookshelves. Can you not? <laughs> Please. I mean, if there's one or two things we leave behind, that's alright. Singular block of marble. Okay. Ah, we'll get this coal. I don't think it's that much. <clears throat> Oops. I swear, I didn't know. Look, look, we have like nothing here. Not even two stacks. We can't come home like that. What are the dogs going to think? That we didn't do anything? Um. Okay, this is just... Ah, uh, okay, I thought this was... Wasn't it the Walker Cobalt stuff? I haven't played in so long. I am sorry. I, I don't know anything about this mod pack anymore. How do you even play this game, really? I mean, this is the collecting marble simulator, right? Where we're just doing our main objective here, I think. Oh, 32 torches now. That is, that's a lovely number. That torch gets to stay there. Oops. That is not what I meant to do. I'll just throw everything into the blocks backpack because I really don't intend to collect millions and millions of stacks of marble here today or in the next recording sessions too so you know if we just have a little bit that is fine with me I'm going to put a silk touch back in there grab the shears back down and we're gonna see if we can find some Ladies flowers question mark oh also those of course death waddle death oil I, I, I always struggle to pronounce them and I don't know why yeah Ooh, jackpot this is where all of them were hiding Zila okay 
Okay, okay, well. Eh, that just shows once again I do not know anything about this mod pack anymore. <laughs> eh! <laughs> Maybe we do have to get the sick touch back out. <clears throat> <sighs> um, real quick. That goes all in there. And we'll actually put the sick touch there. And we'll just put leaf or more pretty flowers. Leave the normal pickaxe here for the marble, so we don't waste the good sneaky touch. C can you please not lag like that? Would be very nice. God, there's so much marble. <laughs> uh, I wanted to collect pretty flowers in this biome and not look at stones. But somehow this is always where we end up. Don't tell me we have two veins. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> Why is there sand here? Okay, these might be two veins though. <clears throat> At least we have a fast pickaxe. <laughs> and not so fast legs. Those are actually very unfortunate. I apologize for that. But, you know. And or uh, how big was the folder for this world? Definitely over five gigabytes by now, so it is understandable in my opinion that occasionally when we load in even more new terrain that it needs to save somewhere. Yeah, little lag spikes here and there are just going to happen. At least the game runs pretty smoothly most of the time, so I'll take it. Okay, we're getting there. We know we still have the other vein that we started, but hopefully there isn't that much in there. I mean, I don't mind the marble, it's actually very useful because we do need a lot. But it's also just not the most exciting thing here, okay? Oh, there's... Oh, it, it paid out in my opinion. <laughs> uh, grab that. I don't know if it sometimes might be C that lags or the gate or just both. Why is it getting dark again? Didn't sign up for them. This would also be a decent place to collect sand, actually. I mean, okay, we have a desert that we're literally mining away. What am I talking about? Don't crash. <laughs> oh, please don't. It is not doing anything right now. <laughs> well, um, yeah, I hope everyone's having a good day. Should I click? Yeah, it's crashing. <sighs> uh, I think I'm actually going to end it here then. Because we're at a decent pausing time. I'm tired. It's 1.30 in the morning. And I'm going to try to sleep. I don't think I can, but I'm going to try. So thank you guys for being here. Have a lovely rest of your night or day, whatever time it is where you are. May your games not crash. And if you play anything that doesn't autosave, remember to save. Very important. Also remember to take your meds and drink enough water. Thank you for being here. I love you. And hopefully the next recording session can be without lags. That would be really nice. So yeah, goodbye!